we are already, and the month is not over, now the hottest September on record. 2024 is going to go down in the record books. Average temperature, 69.8. And that takes all those temperatures and puts them together. And today we are looking at another record setting day, which is going to increase this even more. So it has been hot, it has been dry. Right now in downtown, 63 degrees. Of course, it is dark skies. We're kind of moving into that time of year where the amount of sun we are seeing is definitely starting to shrink just a little bit. Look at these high temperatures. If you are heading up to the mountains to do a little bit of leaf peeping, it is going to be warm. Temps in the 70s, some close to 80 degrees. You're gonna see Aspen right there at 79. Western Slope, Grand Junction, you're one of the hotter spots, 91 degrees. We are also gonna see those 90s, low 90s in that far southeast corner and also up in the northeast corner of the state. Here in the metro area and across the Front Range, temperatures in the upper 80s, low 90s. Denver looking at a high of 91. Roxborough Park, 87. Up in the northern portion of the Front Range, right about 90 degrees. Our average temperature this time of year, 74 degrees. So we are well above where we should be. Let's take you down into Douglas County. You're gonna see Castle Pines looking at a high of 86, Sedalia, 89, and Stonegate. You're gonna see a high today of 88 degrees. So what is going on? We have this massive ridge of high pressure and that is just bringing all of that heat here into the state. This is kind of going to hang around. Now it's going to flatten out just a little bit and that's going to give us the chance to cool our temperatures down tomorrow and then Tuesday. So tomorrow it is going to be warm, 83 degrees, but as that ridge kind of drops down, that is what's going to bring us that front. That's going to cool our temperatures on Tuesday, 78 degrees. Doesn't last very long, and then we're back near 90 on Wednesday. This is another day where we could see record-setting temperatures, keeping those 80s through next weekend, although we could have a little disturbance that's going to cool us back down Sunday and Monday, and that's going to bring our temperatures back to where we should be this time of year. So, Kennedy, you did the smart thing. We're in the yellow. It still feels like summer. It's so